Hi everyone, I'm Brady Hansen. I'm 23 years old from South Florida and I'm coming to you from highperformancemen.com. For fun, I like to swim, read, cook, I like to skateboard, dirt bike. Um, I kind of like just about anything. I can't sit still. So if there's a new opportunity out there, I like to give it a try. I've recently started bodybuilding to keep in shape. Um, I used to be really skinny. So I go to the gym four to five times a week. I segregate my muscle groups and then I just try to eat as much as possible because my metabolism will burn everything off. So, Sexual turn-ons for me would be masculinity. A man's man. I love leather. I love um, just the feel of sweat after a workout or even the smell after a workout. All those kind of things. Body hair, muscle, it all, that's a major turn-on for me. And I like dominance. I like being dominated and having big strong men be able to throw you around a little bit. I think the wildest, kinkiest sexual thing I've ever done before was get a blowjob in the family bathroom of an airport. It was unexpected. I didn't even talk to the other person. Um, and it was risky and it was hot. Three of the main things that can really get me going during sex would be, like I said before, just being manhandled, like rough hands on you, squeezing you, that kind of thing. Um, another one would probably be like ear play, just like them coming in your ear, whispering, that kind of thing, blowing in your ear. And then the third I would probably say is just being fucked hard. <laughs> one thing that I wish I could do, a sexual fantasy that I have, would probably be to be fucked in a sling in front of hundreds of people, like in front of a large group, um, by a big bodybuilder. <laughs> If I could travel anywhere in the world, I would probably go to Machu Picchu because I've heard that it can change your life and I would want to go with my partner. I'd want to be able to take someone that I wanted to spend the rest of my life with to Machu Picchu. The best date for me would probably be something simple, laid back. I'd like to go out and eat. It doesn't have to be somewhere fancy, just be able to pick up some food um, and then go do something fun, go dirt bike riding. Um, go go-karts, just something like that, and then afterward be able to come back and like lay on the couch and watch a movie. That would be the ideal day for me. If I could be any animal, I'd probably be an eagle because they're just bitching. They can fly extremely fast, they're predatory, and they're unbelievably graceful. When you see an eagle, it's inspiring. So, To me, being a high-performance man means just being yourself, being natural, being well, a man's man, that kind of thing, and just doing what comes naturally. It's not anything contrived. It's not having to act a certain way for other people. Just in everyday life, you are yourself, and you are what you believe you should be. So it's a mentality. It's not so much just an attitude. OK, so this scene, this was my first real action shoot I've ever done. and. I loved it a lot. I mean, the whole setting, it's kind of a, it has that just masculine industrial feel, kind of like a gym, locker room, shower scene. And Joe was awesome. I love how aggressive he was. And that's what I want, you know, a real man <laughs> to be able to handle you. So, yeah, I had a lot of fun. Yeah, so did I. <laughs> it, was, uh, it was definitely a good time. I, um, this one's hot. This is a keeper. So, I love the chest. I love the fuzz. Mm, you I too. I love the big cock. Oh my god. I was the one that got to use his, <laughs> so. <laughs> well, let's go it again. Mm, me too. Alright, if I was going to do another scene with Joe, I'd probably want it to involve leather, and I'd probably want to flip. So, like, he fucks me, and then I get to fuck him. That'd be great. Yeah, I'm a top. <laughs> uh, we'll change that. Yeah, a lot of people have tried. But anyway, mm -hmm. um, for me, I like the I like the idea of leather. I like the idea of a sling. Yeah, that would be fun. Yes, it would. Maybe some bars, like a cage. That'd be a lot of fun. Dungeon scene, mm -hmm. something like that. Yeah, definitely.